Sometimes it's important, as a writer, to think about the order in which ideas need to be presented. If I were writing a paper about Julius Caesar's assassination and about the aftermath of that assassination, this particular sentence belongs somewhere else other than at the end of this paragraph. If I'm writing about Cicero, then this, of course, needs to come a little bit earlier in the paragraph. But let's say for the moment that I am, in fact, writing about Julius Caesar's assassination, since that's what most of you are going to be writing about. Let's try reversing the order of this paragraph. Mark Antony ordered the murder of Cicero in 43 BC. It was partly for vengeance against a man who had not done anything to prevent Caesar's murder. It was also done to cow Antony's enemies in the Senate. Cicero, a famous lawyer and senator, was a major landholder and prominent citizen, murdering him strengthened Antony's grip on Rome. So we can see that by choosing our topic sentence or our main idea, we can in fact structure our paragraph much more clearly and cleanly. In this case, Mark Antony ordered the murder of Caesar or of Cicero in 43 BC. It's partly done for vengeance. It's done to cow An Antony's em uh, enemies. And Cicero uh, was a major landholder and prominent citizen, and murdering him strengthened Antony's grip on Rome. The one thing that I don't like here is that uh, this sentence and this sentence disobey Rule 5, use a variety of sentence structures. So we want to change the opening of this sentence so that Mark Antony till, still takes responsibility for the murder, but, um, but that it doesn't have the same structure as this second sentence about cowing Antony's enemies. Let's try making it about Cicero. Cicero had not helped the conspirators murder Caesar, but he had done nothing to prevent the assassination either. and we need a comma here. So from this structure, we can see that we've gone from one, two, three lines in our original example to five lines, but it's a much more interesting experience for our readers using this format than using this format, and so we'll stick with it for now.